good morning students today we are going to learn about statistics by the end of today's class we are going to learn about the definition of statistics and the measures of central tendency what are the measures of central tendency here they are mean median and mode first come into the definition of statistics what is statistics a study dealing with the collection presentation and interpretation and analysis of data is known as statistics so in the measures of central tendency the first one we are going to learn about mean the definition of mean is given by it is the average of the number of observations it is calculated by dividing the sum of values of the observations by the total number of observations it is represented by x bar the mean x bar of n values that is x0 x1 x2 x3 up to so on xn is given by x bar is equals to x0 plus x1 plus x2 plus so on plus xn whole divided by n this is the definition of mean now we go with one example find the mean of the first six whole numbers we look at the solution first we write the six whole numbers what are the six whole numbers here they will start from zero that is zero one two three four five so these are the first six whole numbers now we find the mean so mean equals to what we have learnt sum of observations by number of observations that is 0 plus 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 4 plus 5 whole divided by 6 so what we get numerator after adding all these six whole numbers we get 15 so this is 15 by 6 is equals to 5 by 2 when we write in the decimal representation it is equals to 2.5 so the mean of first six whole numbers is equals to 2.5 next the second measure of central tendency is median the median is the middle value of the given number of observations which divides into exactly two parts for the median of ungrouped data we arrange the data into ascending order and we calculate as follows look at the table here the data is given as 15 72 44 26 66 38 91 so the first step to find the median is we have to arrange the data in ascending order that is 15 26 38 44 66 72 91 now the next step is the number of observations are 7 so from the left side we take out 3 that is 15 26 and 38 and from the right side we take out 3 that is 66 72 and 91 we get middle most value is 44 so the median of the given data is 44 so we note here if the number of observations is odd then the median will be n plus 1 by 2 whole th term as in the above figure the number of observations is 7 that is odd so the median will be n plus 1 by 2 that is 7 plus 1 by 2 that is 8 by 2 is equals to fourth term so the fourth term is after arranging the observations in the ascending order the fourth term is 44 that is the example if the number of observations is even then the median is the average of n by 2 and n by 2 plus 1th term now we look at the example of median of finding the observations which are even look at the example find the median of the following data 6 comma 7 comma 10 comma 12 comma 13 comma 4 comma 8 comma 12 here if you look at the number of observations are 8 so that is even number so first of all what is the step we need to arrange them in the ascending order so after arranging in the ascending order we get 4 comma 6 comma 7 comma 8 comma 10 comma 12 comma 12 comma 13 as the number of observations is even 
we have noted that the median is the average of n by 2 and n by 2 plus 1th term. n by 2 means value is 8 by 2 is equals to 4 and n by 2 plus 1 means 8 by 2 plus 1 that is 4 plus 1 is equals to 5. Fourth term is 8 and fifth term is 10. So, the median will be average of 8 and 10 that is 8 plus 10 by 2 is equals to 18 by 2 is equals to 9. So, the median of the data given is equals to 9. Third measure of central tendency is mode. What is the definition of mode? The mode is the value of the observation which shows the number that occurs most frequently in the data. That is number of observations which has the maximum frequency is known as the mode. One example if you look at find the mode of the following data. Data is given as 15, 20, 22, 25, 30, 20, 15, 20, 12, 20. Here the number 20 appears maximum number of times. So, mode is equals to 20. So, the observation which occurs most frequently in the data is known as a mode. So, here one note we are going to learn that the empirical relation between the three measures of central tendency is 3 median is equals to mode plus 2 mean.